and welcome back to another video. My name is Leah if you're new to my channel and if you're a returning subscriber then thank you so much for coming back. If you are new please make sure that you hit that subscribe button below. I would love for you to stick around and join the family and I'm also going to be announcing my giveaway at 1000 subscribers so again if you haven't already please make sure that you subscribe below and I'll be announcing my giveaway shortly. So as you can tell by the title of today's video, this is going to be a review. Now I just want to start off by saying that I'm not selling these products myself, so this is completely unbiased. A friend of mine is actually selling them and she kindly sent some to me, so it's not sponsored, but they were gifted and I will of course be giving you my honest opinions of them. Now the products are from the company Federico Mahora. I really hope that I've said that right. Um, I think they're also known as FM World and FM Fragrances. You might have seen um, like friends and family selling them online as well and you might be curious. So Federico Mahora are their own brand and rather than pumping a load of money into like advertising and packaging, they choose to actually number their bottles instead. That way it makes it way more affordable and they come in at between, I think it is, let me just double check. £14.90 and £24.50 and these fragrances it is just really important to know that they're not copies, that they're not fakes, they are simply designer inspired. So I'm not expecting these to smell exactly the same but if they do then what a bonus. So I just want to start by showing you the packaging and how these fragrances arrived. So the first two came in packaging like this which I absolutely love. I think the packaging is very like clean, very classy. This is the sort of packaging that I go for when I pick up like skincare products and stuff as well. So I was really happy with that. And the other one came in a bigger package like this. Again, it's very clean, very classy looking. And I believe this one actually might be unisex. I do need to just double check actually. Okay, so here we have number 489. And this one is inspired by Thierry Mugler Alien and that is the bottle that it comes in. I just think that these look so nice, so I think I'm just gonna give this a smell. Okay, I can definitely tell straight away that this is inspired by Alien, and this is so strong, I've not even sprayed this yet. It's got that sort of like deep scent to it, I can't really explain it, but if you've smelled Alien, you probably have, then you will know exactly what I'm talking about. Oh wow. I'm so impressed with that one. That smells so good. I literally have worn Alien for probably like 15 years now and I pretty much know it like the back of my hand and that smells very, very similar, if not exactly the same. So in terms of being inspired by that fragrance, then I would say they've got this one absolutely spot on. So I definitely recommend this one. Again, it is number 489. So next we have number 431, which is inspired by Carolina Herrera, Good Girl. Now, if I remember rightly, this is the one where it's in like the shoe packaging. Is that right? Let me just double check this because if it is, I've been wanting to try this. Now, I've never actually smelled that fragrance before, but I kind of like that I don't have anything to compare it to. So I'm really interested to see what this smells like. And if I like it, it's gonna be a bit of a surprise for me. So I think, let's just spray it onto my opposite hand. Oops. Ooh. Okay, that smells so good. I do not know what I was expecting, but I wasn't expecting that, but this is like totally in a good way. I think that I was expecting a fragrance that was a bit more, um, like maybe for an older person. I thought, you know, maybe it's the name, like Carolina Herrera, it sounds very like boss woman, but no, it kind of has like a very clean and crisp smell to it, but also like the tiniest bit of sweet as well. I don't like perfumes that are too sweet or like overly sweet, so this is perfect. And I just think this would be perfect for like a holiday fragrance. So again, this is number 431 and it's inspired by Carolina Herrera, Good Girl. And lastly, I'm gonna be trying the unisex one, which is number 909 and this is inspired by Tom Ford Velvet Orchid. Now again, I've never smelled that before, so I'm interested to see if I like this. And also I like that it's unisex so that me and Ryan can both use it if we like it. I think I'm gonna spray it. I'll spray it on this arm because it doesn't smell like an alien even though I sprayed that on my hand. Do you know what? 
I actually do really like that. It's never something that I would have chosen though, but I could imagine Ryan wearing this. And to be honest, I'd probably wear it myself. It's like, it's different. It's got very like, it's a very strong smell and it's very like, it's very rich in smell as well, if that makes any sense. I'm actually really interested to see how this wears as well over the next few hours. So that brings us to the end of this video and this review. I really hope that you've enjoyed watching it and it has been somewhat helpful to you as well. So I think that this has been really successful. I'm very pleased with these products. I don't know what I was expecting really, but they have gone above and beyond anything that I was expecting. And I'm definitely gonna be going back and ordering some more. I mean, they smell strong, the quality is good, the packaging looks nice. They're in handy size bottles and they are affordable. So what more could you want really? So like I said, earlier i'm not selling these but if you want to purchase them then i would highly recommend you heading over to lauren's instagram page which i'll put here and i will also link in the description as well um, again as well if you wanted to sign up and earn yourself a bit of extra cash then definitely go through lauren she was a previous manager of mine i know that she's a great manager i can speak from personal experience so i know that she will be a great person to get you set up and guide you through running your own little business as well. So just a few more things that I'd like to touch on. If you did want to sign up, you'd be classed as a business partner for FM. Um, you don't have to keep any stock. You can simply order it from the warehouse when the customer places the order with you. Um, and there are three different ways that you can get paid. So I'm sorry, I'm just reading this off my phone because my memory is like a sieve at the moment. I cannot remember anything. So, um, so yeah, there are three ways to get paid. So the first one is instant profit. You buy at a cost price and then you sell it on for retail. Um, number two, for every bottle you sell, you receive points and points equal commission. Um, as an upline, the company also match your team's points to give you the same. So they're not taking anything off the DOW lines or Dow lines. I don't really, I'm not 100% how this works because obviously I'm not part of it myself. Um, this gives you the opportunity to out earn the person who introduced you to the business, so your upline. Um, number three, there is no pressure with regards to targets. You can work your business at your own pace. However, there are bonus schemes. You can enter and receive up to £800 on top of your profit and commission if you successfully hit the targets. So if you've enjoyed watching this video, I really hope that you have. Please make sure that you smash that thumbs up button for me. Please click subscribe. I would love for you to stick around and I'll see you in my next video.